How's it guys? How's it guys? How's it guys? Uh, we're back again. My name is Stu. And my name is Aris. Guys, welcome to the World Cup. We is our first episode as we promised. Uh, we're going to be talking the big match that's happening on Friday. Uh, Portugal and Spain. Whew. I'm going to have to sit down for this one. That's what it. Think? Yeah, that's it. Eh? That's it. Mm. Guys, I'm just going to be very, very um, honest with you guys. I'm not here. I'm not coming here as a neutral or what. I like I like Portugal and I like Cristiano Ronaldo. Ooh, you starting already. <laughs> uh, my, you rival, start my rival here. <laughs> you are, can I tell you what? Mm. Come on. I have Pepe, you know. <laughs> you have Pepe. <laughs> oh. uh, yeah. I have Sergio Ramos. Oh, what? Uh, the what evil one. <laughs> the evil one. The one that everyone hates. You know, you know what it did to me. But it, it's a pity that Sergio Ramos plays for Real Madrid and uh, I know he helped Ronaldo win the Champions League but you know, the guy is so evil, hey? Uh, I have Pepe, you know, the, 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 the most hardest defender in the world at the moment, you know, always feisty and so yeah, I give it, I give it to Portugal, hey? <laughs> I give it to Portugal. I you think, think? You, you're looking at a different movie in this moment. <laughs> yeah. No, but the reality is Portugal is a good team. Yeah. Pep is, a, as you say, is a very yeah. tough yeah. player. Yeah. But you can't compare with Piquet, with Sergio Ramos. Yeah. We're coming with experience. We're coming with winners. Yeah. We won Champions League. We yeah. won La Liga. Yeah. We won World Cup. Yes, in 2010, unfortunately. Mm. But maybe, maybe. Okay, let's just look. Because who last one thing? Who won? We won the European Championship, and Spain were in absolute shambles. Uh, when in, in in the last World Cup and in, at the Euros as well, they were horrible. And Portugal, they won the, the Euro Championship in 2016. We're more on a higher note than, than you guys. We won the yeah. first World Cup host in Africa. We are in the history of football. Right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all right. Uh, I'll give you to that. I'll give that one to you. But you know what? Let's check our attacks. I have Cristiano Ronaldo, marvelous player, five Ballon d'Ors. Who do you have in the Spanish attack? I mean, you have all these new guys that just recently came. Diego Costa hasn't been in the Spanish team for a long time. Who's going to score goals for you? Who's going to who's gonna drive that team for you? Obviously, you just mentioned the name. Yeah. Diego Costa yeah. was the best striker for me in Premier League. Put any defender under pressure. He has personality. He's strong. He likes fighting in a proper way. You know, maybe yeah. <laughs> that fighting against paper. Yeah. will create we'll some create fire, a bit of fire eh? but I think it's bringing the personality that you, it was missing in the, yeah, in the in Spanish, the Spanish team. team yeah I hear what you're saying but I have you know when you have Cristiano Ronaldo I mean there's always a possibility hey there's always a possibility absolutely there's always a possibility I mean like really if you look at this Portugal team it's a it's a it's a mix a young team and 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 and, and people that are old but you know, experience and youth, you know what comes out of that uh, yeah. experience. Yeah. Look, look at yeah. us. Yeah. Marco Asensio, yeah. Isco, mm -hmm. young yeah. players, but yeah. with massive experience yeah. already on the international level. Yeah. Come on. Do you have this kind of player that I just mentioned now? Yeah, well, of course. Bernardo Silva. Whoa, fantastic player. You know, Bernardo Silva, he, he actually, he was fantastic. I know he was fantastic at Monaco, but there was a time where Pai Sterling got injured in in the Manchester City team and I remember correct. and Bernardo Silva was just amazing. He was a fantastic player to watch. And you I have Bernardo Silva, I have Jean But Jean we Mario. have the strategy yeah. against Bernardo Silva. Uh, yeah. It's very simple. Yeah. He receive the ball, yeah. he come inside, yes. he can shoot with both feet. Yeah. We just need to stay inside the box, you know, and waiting for his movement. You know, <laughs> Sergio Ramos see. Piquet can easily intercept him. Oh, easily, see. easily. You'll see. You'll see. Ronaldo and Ramos, that's going to be very, very interesting. Pepe and Diego Costa, interesting one as well. But I'm telling you, I would like to lean on Ronaldo. Ronaldo and Ramos, Ronaldo knows Ramos at the back of his head. Eh? I hope he does. I'm, I'm sure also Ramos is not going to do the Salah on, on, on Ronaldo because yeah. he knows that if he does the Salah, then he's going to miss him for the, maybe for the next season. It well. might happen because <laughs> we don't know if Ronaldo is going to stay Real Madrid. So. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, but Ramos is a winner, yes. So I wouldn't put it past him eh, to head Ronaldo because Ramos would do anything to win. But you know, all in all, this is going to be a fantastic match. I sure. can't wait. This is what you've been waiting for. This is what the World Cup means to us, to the world. You know, I can't wait. I can't wait. So let's score predictions quickly. Uh, two nil for Spain. Ah, two nil Spain. <laughs> no way. Uh, no, I'd like to give it to 
One nil to Portugal, Cristiano Ronaldo. No, 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 no. One nil. No, no, I want a hat trick. Hat trick, Ronaldo, Ramos. They're gonna treat him like a kid, eh? like a small kid, like that he is. Uh, he thinks that Ronaldo is Salah. No, no, no. Ronaldo is Ronaldo, Cristiano Ronaldo, five Ballon d'Ors. And he's on the sixth, he's going to, to win the sixth one. No, I understand, but yeah. remember also the final of the Champions League. Where was Ronaldo? Where was Ronaldo? <laughs> My Sergio uh, Ramos was there. Yeah. Present, <laughs> strong. We know what happened. Yeah. Question for you. Yeah. Who's going to be the X Factor player besides Cristiano Ronaldo for your team? Like I said before, we have Bernardo Silva. We have another young player there, Justin Martins. Very good on the wings, runs with the ball very well. And uh, we have Jean Mario. Jean Mario, we all know what Jean Mario is capable of when he plays no, for we Portugal. Don't know. <laughs> we don't know when he played for West Ham. I know. <laughs> no, don't count West Ham. The, the whole West Ham team was struggling, it was going down. So I wouldn't really count that. But when he dons that Portuguese shirt, it's just a, a complete different mm. player. We'll see though, um, guys, um, we're going to be discussing the next match. Don't want to miss out. You don't want to miss out those points. As of course, you're going to grow stronger as the World Cup goes by. There's more points to talk about, but let's just enjoy this first one. It's Spain and Portugal. It's going to be a hub thing. What do you think? So look, it's going to be fire. We're so excited. Mm. Don't forget to share, yeah. like our page, exactly. come on our YouTube channel exactly. to watch you are any episode. To you are allowed to comment as well. Drop your comments, your likes, and shares. And please don't forget to subscribe, guys. Subscribe. It's gonna be, subscribe, please. It's gonna be an awesome adventure. And uh, you know, it's only getting started. We're gonna go stronger as the as the World Cup goes by. Thank you very much for watching. I wanna say goodbye yeah. in Spanish. Good. Adios. Yeah. Okay. Same Portuguese. <laughs> Next time. Shop <laughs> shop. Thank you. Bye. <laughs>